Hello everyone, I'm here with Mark with Georgia Lightscapes and as when it go when, when with regards to energy efficiency in commercial and residential, lighting is one of those forgotten elements that people don't think about. They think about water heating, they, they think, think about heating and cooling, but lighting can contribute to the energy load in a commercial and residential space quite a bit. So Mark's got a company here that can help reduce the lighting load, looks like in commercial spaces. Yeah, that's right. You can. Uh First thing you can save your electric bill. You can change your save your electric bill from uh, at least half in from a fluorescent to an LED. You're gonna save anywhere from 40 to 50 percent electric bill. Your return on investment is usually about a year, year and a half, and after that, it's just all savings. Uh, our company personally we give a five-year warranty on on parts and labor, so you're really guaranteed to make all you know, whatever investment you have in your lights. You're gonna make it all back usually within a year and a half. And so then that's not included. Also, the, the savings you have on your maintenance for changing bulbs or or ballasts or any other maintenance issues you have. So going to LED is just a huge saving. It's a great technology. And the fixtures now are even lasting up to, uh, for like a 100,000 hour fixture, you know, you're gonna get upwards of 20 years out of that fixture at 12 hours a night. So yeah, it's a, it's a huge saving you get converting to LED. Got it, so one thing that people don't really think about, you've got in your sign over here, it says it lowers the HVAC. So explain how the lighting load can reduce the HVAC load. So when incandescent bulbs, they get very, very hot. And so it actually warms up all of your common areas. So going to a fluorescent actually reduces your heat, but then we go to an LED, it actually reduces it even much more. So an LED bulb usually gets a little bit warm, but it never gets hot. This has a big effect on your HVAC uh, in the condos whenever you have like, you know, hundreds and hundreds of, uh, of bulbs throughout a, uh, you know, all your buildings. So yeah, it, it makes your, uh, it's a less load on your HVAC unit. So you'll save electricity, not just on your lighting bill, but just in general on your HVAC in general. So that, that helps a lot also. So I noticed you've got Georgia in your name, but do you work outside of Georgia as well? Uh, we start off in Georgia, but actually we're in the whole Southeast. So anywhere in the, the general area of the Southeast we go to. Got it. So um, I know there could be a huge upfront cost for these, and I know there's some financing plans out there. Is that something that you guys offer as well to help finance the, the, um, the savings? Yeah, there's lots of options we have, some connections that we have as far as the loan officer. So if you wanted to uh, do the project and finance it, and usually uh, your monthly cost to your uh, on your financing usually is what your savings equals to in your uh, in your electric bill. So whatever you save your electric bill, uh, you know you apply it towards your loan. So most time it doesn't really cost anything out of pocket. So um, so yeah, there's lots of options to, to finance that. And then at the end of the term, you own the lights. So basically you're financing it, you're not coming out of pocket anymore, and then you've got a capital improvement. And generally speaking, it's not like a long-term loan over 20 years. As I said, the return on investment is only about a year and a half. So even if you got a loan that's just for a year or two years, uh, so all the money you would save in your electric bill, you apply towards your loan. So it's really no out of cost pockets for you. So and like, again, it would be a very short-term loan because you'd make all your money back within less than two years. Oh, but you're also doing a good thing for the environment. You're um, lowering um, the, the, the amount of electricity that you need and helping decrease uh, loads on HVAC. So so the, the lights that you're putting in, so it takes maybe a couple years to pay it back. Like what's the average lifespan of some of these lights? Well, like I so said, we personally give a five-year warranty, parts on labor for anything that we do. Uh, but generally speaking, like I so said, your light's going to last, um, you know, upwards of, depending on the light fixture you do, but as I said, they're always getting better. So right now, your your average light is going to be the 100,000 hour light, which is going to last uh, upwards of 20 years. So, like I so said, they're getting better every year. So this takes two years to pay back, um, on average, and you're warranting for at least five years. That's a 250% return on investment. Exactly. Uh, that's it's, that. kind of a, it's an easy sell because you, you make all of your money back just in your savings. So. Yeah. So even if you can't do math, 250% is more than 100%. So that, exactly. that, 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 that's a good thing. Yeah, exactly. All right, well, I appreciate your time, Mark. Yeah, thank you. Thanks for watching this video. For more information on topics like this, we invite you to search for other products, services, companies, and people on the Rate It Green directory. Unlike other websites, searching is free, listing is free, becoming a member is free, and listing your green products is free. Thanks again for watching this video. And if you liked the video, give us a thumbs up. And for more information on this product and other products like it, we've got a link in the description. Uh, we've loaded up some more videos just like this in a playlist off to the right. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. See you next time.